Okay, so um, part two of the uh, of the video showing uh, the exhaust grill. Um, a couple of people commented that they'd like to see what it looks like lit up. Now, at the moment, I've not um, I've not really built the uh, the Falcon at all, so uh, you know it's a it's a way off me actually installing the lights. Um, I mean, it's fairly sort of common knowledge by now that. Um, you know, the lighting that's provided is it's sort of okay, but um, it's not the best. Particularly the fact that there's a join in the housings uh, and leaving a gap, which leaves a dark spot on the uh, on the on the light that's provided. Um, and eventually, I'm intending to chop all this out and join the two boxes together with with you know no no gap in the centre. Um, and I'll probably install maybe three um, lines of um, LEDs um, to give a much uh, much more even pattern of light. Um, so with that in mind, um, just to show off the you know the grill as is, um, I've got a couple of these um, LED inspection lights, um, which. Um, I've used for various things in the past, but um, you know they're they're, they're pretty bright, um, as you can see. Um, and I just thought I'd use one of those as a as an example of um, how it's uh, how it's going to look when it's attached. So I've taped it onto one of these um, lighting boxes, and um, I'm hoping the camera will pick this up because quite often when you sort of take photos or film. LEDs they they, uh, they they just show up as too bright and the sort of the whiteness washes everything out but um, I'll have a look at the video and see what it looks like so um, there's the the backlight film on the back of the the etch and uh, it's taped down onto this uh, inspection light so I'll try switching it on and um, see what that glow looks like it's got this nice sort of blue haze around the edge with the white light in the center um, if I knock off the lights completely, um, that might show it better. As I say, I'll need to look at the video first to to see how this comes out. Um, but to the eye, it's pretty much perfect. There's there's no sort of blue line. It it just fades from white into blue very naturally. Um, and I think once this is installed, it'll just give that very faint blue haze to the edge which uh, is what um, what appears on screen um, so um, I, I think it looks excellent um, obviously it remains to be seen um, how it looks when I install the lights but um, I'm pretty sure that the lights are going to be as bright as uh, as this inspection light so um, you know we'll uh, we'll see how it comes out but I can certainly recommend this to anyone who had doubts about um, you know how it looks compared to the uh, the Diagostini one um, it's a it's a vast improvement, so um, I'll leave it there. Thanks for watching.